Unreal. Never seen it this high. What are you doing? Hey, let's go. Up. <laughs> Good girl. She's dirty, but hopefully as we go up towards the wall, it'll clear up. Let's do it. Righto guys, out here on Windermere today, first uh, fish of the spring, although it's still mid-August. Just thought I'd come out, we've had like shit weather for the last sort of oh, month I reckon. And today we've actually got bluebird sky, real light winds. It's the first day in ages that just pinnacle conditions. So I thought I'd come out here, have a look. The dam, I believe it's just hit 80%. So I've actually never seen this much water in Windermere before. It's uh, pretty cool. Looks awesome. There's that much water. Um, I was a bit concerned down the front, the boat ramp, it was um, on the back, uh, really dirty. Uh, but once you get sort of halfway into that main basin, that all clears back up and the water up here looks really good. So, yeah, I think we've got to about 17 degrees today. Light wind, it's, it's lunch, it's one o'clock now. I only got to probably fish till about five. See if we can't catch a few fish. See if we can't see what they're doing. If they're on the edge yet, they might not. Um, but it has been quite cold, so I suspect it'll be tough and they, they won't be on the edge yet, but there might be a few poking around. So, see what happens. Got the uh, new Daiwa Steve Soft Shell couple of those some old samples that i'm gonna throw around they're not out yet but i'm gonna chuck them around and some jerk baits um yeah hopefully we can get onto a few fish got zigs with me she's back out she's already spotted a few goats so hopefully she stays in the boat anyway let's see how we go eh? all right I'll watch it watch it denny denny We'll just have a bit of a poke around, see if we can't see a bit of action on the live scope, see where the, if there's any fish sitting up on this edge, or this fresh ground. Plenty of uh, gum trees are going to lose their lives. I'm actually surprised the water is crystal clear up here, which is good. Righto. Jackal squirrel, 67. Track a bit of S fact on there. It's going to be the first bait we use. He's all lathered up. Just chuck the uh, soft shell, soft fob on. They seem to be sitting a few on the bottom, on this edge. So the life coat. So I'm just going to give this a shake. Down here. So far, no bingo. 
had a bit of interest, a couple of good follows on the um, on the jerk bait. Nothing on the soft shell yet. Uh, it's just because it's come up so quickly, the water level. There's a fair bit of muck and um, just slime and shit on the bottom. So shaking that that soft shell is pretty hard going. Just went um, up on the bank, just took a zig up so she could have a leak and um, she walked past something and turned around real quick and yeah, just that big, that big red belly. Uh, I was a little bit concerned. She was about 20 meters away when she did it, but don't think it tagged or anything. She was just inquisitive with it. Went over, I was like, oh, surely not. Middle of August, wouldn't be a snake. Walked over there, told her to get away. Sure enough, dirty big, dirty big black snake. And uh, he had a bit of go about him too. He was cruising. Um, first, first warmish day <laughs> in ages. And, and yeah, they're out and about. Thick as too. Anyway, we're gonna um, keep going along. It's getting on now. Um, yeah, not really, not really doing any good with the fishing. So it's good to be out here having a bit of a look around, see what's going on. There is fish up on the edge. You can see them on the live scope cruising around, but they're just not that keen. Anyway, we'll keep uh, seeing if we can't get one. Yes. <laughs> oh, finally. That was sick. That was sick on the jerk bait. <laughs> She's been slow, slow going. Watch out. Watch out. Alright, we're on the board. On the squirrel. What is it, Zig? The heck is that, Sheen? There he is. Crunch that squirrel, the gold colour. It's actually not a bad fish, pretty long. Go okay, well on the comp. There we go. First uh, first yellow belly for the spring. Hopefully there's uh, plenty more of these guys. Zig! She's just obsessed looking out there. Yeah, not bad. Get him back in the water. Might. So this is the new soft vibe, Daiwa Steve's soft shell. Um, of, this is a sample. They're not coming out till mid-October, I believe. Uh, but I, Copper and I both uh, had some samples from last year that we were fishing out here. Did quite well on them. Well on them. Uh, out here at Windy. Uh, it wasn't a great season for soft vibes as a whole uh, due to the weed. The slime was pretty hard, but 
we still got some good fish. So this year I'm looking forward to using these. Fishing that on the new one of the new zero rods. So those people that watch me channel would know that I love using the zeros uh, for the yellow belly fishing, all types of fishing. This one's actually, I, I normally run the 722 ULS, which has been my favorite soft fly rod, but I've actually gone to a 742 LXS, so a little bit longer and a little bit heavier stick. Actually, uh, for shaking the soft vibes, it's bang on. So, no good on the soft vibe yet. Uh, it's just with the amount of stuff on the bottom, making it a bit tough, but as this water level starts to settle, and the, the ground will clear up a bit. I think it'll really go off on them. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. Done everything but eat at that fish. Wow. Far out. Just trying to refine that technique. I need to work out how to get them to commit sometimes. I can get them following it. Just can't get them to commit. <laughs> That's sick. It's only tiny, tiny, tiny yellow belly. It's good fun, but <laughs> watch out, Zig. Hey, watch out, Ziggy. Away, away. away. Here we go. They did say don't get much smaller than that wind to me. Good fun, but. Right, I guys, back at the ramp. It's gonna wrap us up. Quick little session, bit of fun. Couple of yellows in the boat. Um, yeah, it's still pretty tough out there. It's a good day, uh, but the first good day, water temp's still about 12 degrees. So, although I did see a fair few fish on the edge on the live scope, um, they're just not really chewing yet. But once we start getting those temps for us, you know, a couple of, or maybe a week of consistent, good sunny days, uh, they'll really come on. The the dam looks unreal, uh, like every dam in in the on the east side of Australia at the moment. We've had so much rain, and I think uh, once we do warm up a little bit, get those temps up, I think it's going to be a really good season out here on the Yellow Belly. So, going to keep trying. You know, I'll probably come back out another fortnight if we get some nice weather and uh, see how we go then. Anyway, cheers for watching. I'll see you in the next one.